वेलकम बैक इन दिस लेक्चर वी विल लर्न अबाउट क्लस्टर ऑटो स्केलिंग फीचर वी विल लर्न हाउ एंड वेन क्लस्टर ऑटो स्केलिंग इज बेनिफिशियल एंड इन विच सिनेरियोज क्लस्टर ऑटो स्केलिंग इज नॉट वेरी यूजफुल सो लेट्स स्टार्ट विद द प्रॉब्लम स्टेटमेंट वी हैव अ डेटा प्रोसेसिंग पाइपलाइन विद द फॉलोइंग फैक्ट्स वी हैव एन एस एल ए टू फिनिश द जॉब इन लेस दैन सिक्सटी मिनट्स द जॉब टेक्स फिफ्टी फाइव मिनट्स विद वन टेराबाइट डेटा वॉल्यूम we may get 1.5 terabyte data volume occasionally and still want to meet our sla right that's the problem statement and this problem statement is carried forwarded from the previous lecture in the previous lecture we benchmarked one of our job where same kind of requirement was there and here are the estimates and results we estimated that we will be using four cpu cores per executor 14 gb memory per executor and we will be using 20 executors to run this job in production and that uh, brings us 80 cpu cores in total for this job we benchmarked it with 1 terabyte of data the job took 55 minutes uh, we know that we can still meet our sla sla is to finish job within 60 minutes and we managed to finish it in 55 minutes so for 1 terabyte data we could meet our sla but the challenge is that the buffer is very less our target is 60 minutes we took 55 minutes to finish this job only 10% margin is there and we also know that our data volume may increase by 50% occasionally but it may increase and there may be situations like uh, peak hours or uh, some campaigns or some events uh, which are causing this increase in the data volume by 50% so if our data becomes 1.5 terabyte can we still meet our sla can we finish this job within 60 minutes if 1 terabyte is taking 55 minutes i'm sure 1.5 terabyte will take definitely take more than 60 minutes so we will break our sla so how do we handle that how do we meet this requirement the question here is can we leverage auto scaling to meet our sla when input data suddenly grows to 1.5 terabyte 